So when you've finished your survey and you want to have a look to see what you've done, simply press the stop button down here. Make sure that you're not on the camera so the LED is off. Press the stop button and it will stop. Then you press the menu button on the keypad function here and this will bring up the menu screen. Move across to browse and press select. Press select on the USB stick which we're using. Press select on the drive required. And on this particular USB it's the D drive. Go into your recordings and your recording will come up. If you want to make it a larger screen just press select and it will give you a larger screen. Now I'll run through a few of the key functions which help you do your survey. Obviously you've got the up, down, left, right buttons which toggle your cursor around the screen. Now you can put things wherever you like on the screen by simply using the F functions. For instance, F4 is for the counter. So wherever the cursor is, if you press F4, the counter appears. Again, if you press F4, it will disappear. F6 puts the date, F7 puts the date up, sorry, and F6 puts the time up. Again, if you press them, they will disappear and reappear wherever the cursor is. When you're actually moving down the pipe, and the counter starts counting up. If you wish to zero this, you press the F5 key and the enter button, which will zero the counter. Go. Now on this particular keypad, there are six pages. You cannot save any text on page one. To simply save text, move up to page two, and it will indicate page two is what you're on. If you press escape, it will clear the page. Then you can type in your details. Now to save them details, just press up page, go on to page 3, and then when you return to page 2, the details you wrote will be there. Again, if you put your, your counter up or the date, it will all come back to that page when you come back onto it. But if you're on page 1, which is a startup page, you cannot save any data. If you feel the meterage is slightly out, you can calibrate it yourself by following these simple steps. If you press F1, it lists a number of options. The drum you're using is drum 1, so go down to drum 1 and press enter. It gives you another four options. If you press enter on counter, go down to pull out and press enter. Go down to start and press enter. And now it's asking you to pull out 10 metres. So simply come down to the cable reel itself. Roughly gauge a metre. I've left the metre ruler out so I know exactly where it is. And I pull out 10 metres. Once the 10 metres have been pulled out, simply press enter on the end, where it's highlighted end, press enter. Then press escape until you get back to your main page. Press F5 and zero the counter. Now when you pull out the cable, the meterage should be counting for the calibration that you've set. There are other functions that you can use on the keypad itself. If I quickly bring the cursor into view for you. For instance, if you press F4, you can put the meterage up. Now you could add captions and all sorts to this. Just simply press F1, go down to the drum one, press enter. For instance, if I press enter on caption, now when I press escape and go back to the main screen, when I put the meterage up again, you'll notice it comes up with main. This is the caption that it adds with that function. To get rid of it, you just go back down to drum one, 
press enter and press enter on the caption and now that will be removed. You can also change the direction by pressing enter on direction. Now when we come out, if I press F4, obviously the caption has moved. But when I pull out, because I've changed the direction, it now comes out minus instead of plus. Sometimes people press this accidentally, so I'm just letting you know. That's pretty much it for this unit. I'll just quickly mention there's a brake on the side here that you turn in and out to create tension on the reel when you're pulling it in and out. If you have any further problems with this piece of equipment, then call our service team on 0203 253 2001. Thanks for your time.